Echocardiogram is an image of the heart using ultrasound. An ultrasound beam is transmitted into the body using a device known as transducer. The echo received from the body is processed by the computer and the machine to give a moving image of the heart. Transesophageal echocardiogram or TE is obtained by introducing a special type of transducer also called a TE probe into the esophagus and stomach. Usual echocardiogram is obtained by placing the transducer or probe on the chest. Lungs may overlap the heart intermittently while imaging the heart from the chest wall. This is because the lungs cover part of the heart during inspiration and interferes with the image quality. In those with hyperinflated lungs as in emphysema, this causes poor echo window. In TE, as the probe is in the esophagus, there is no interference by the overlapping of lungs. Esophagus is just behind the heart so that the distance which the ultrasound beam has to travel to reach the heart is also small. For both these reasons, the images obtained by TE has much superior quality compared to external imaging. While imaging nearby structures, higher frequency transducers can be used, increasing the image resolution. Higher frequencies cannot be used in transthoracic echocardiography because of attenuation at higher distances. TE is very useful in picking up small clots and vegetations on heart walls. This helps in the diagnosis of potentially life-threatening conditions like infective endocarditis. It can evaluate atrial septal defects much better than transthoracic echocardiography. Detection of clots in the left atrial appendage prior to planned elective cardioversion for atrial fibrillation is another important role for TEE. Looking for left atrial appendage clots is also important in post-stroke evaluation. TEE is widely used by cardiac surgeons to get real-time assessment of cardiac structures after repair of congenital heart disease and wall repair. As it can be done intraoperatively, surgeons can immediately correct any residual defects before coming out of cardiopulmonary bypass and anesthesia. Transthoracic echocardiography is difficult during open heart surgery as the chest wall is open. Using a device over the open chest is likely to affect the sterility of the procedure and lead to contamination and infections. But there is no such problem with TE as it does not interfere with the operating field. The imaging is done from the esophagus behind the heart. Now, is there any disadvantage for transesophageal echocardiogram? The most important disadvantage is the semi-invasive nature. Some feel it uncomfortable to have the long probe introduced through the throat. This can be reduced by giving anesthetic sprays and application of local anesthetic gel. A good explanation of the planned procedure and motivation are also helpful. Those with obstructions or diseases of the esophagus can have complications when the device is introduced. The operator should be well trained in the procedure and in interpretation of the images. Unlike in transthoracic echocardiography, it is not easy to repeat the study often. Supporting personnel to monitor the patient during procedure is also necessary. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, like, share and post your valuable comment below this video. Kindly press the bell icon after that for getting all updates.